Today I'd like to tie for you a little variation on the Prince Nymph. And this is the Dark Lord. This fly was designed by David Swart. And I've never tied it before. He just sent me a picture, so I'm going to give it my best shot. The hook I have in a vise is a size 10, 2 extra long nymph hook, and I have a 3 millimeter bead. I'm going to use black thread. I'm going to put a base of thread down to the back of the hook. Dave says he catches steelhead with this. I'm sure it will catch trout. It will catch smallmouths. Anything that will eat nymphs is going to eat this. We're going to start with the tail and I'm going to use brown goose biots. I'm going to use the natural curve of the biot to keep them separated. And we want this to be the length of the hook shank. I'm going to tie the, my side first. Just a couple of wraps to keep it on there. Measure that up. Yeah, I'm going to pull these a little bit shorter. little too much on that one there we go and secure these in place remove that excess tie that down I'm gonna put on the rib and I have a medium copper wire I'm going to take the end and I'm going to put the end right in the bead. And we're going to tie that down. That will help stabilize that bead a bit. And I'm going to bring that right back to the tail once again. And we're gonna leave it leave that there for now. I'm gonna wax up my thread. I'm going to take black antron blend. For the body. And we're going to wind that body. And you don't have to get all the way to the front. Take our rib, copper wire, and we're going to wind that forward. And as always, I like to pull the wire ribbing pretty tight. Not going to break it. Tie that in. And I'm going to remove the excess. I'm going to take a hen saddle hackle. And this is a very dark one, almost black. Give it that crew cut. And tie that in.
take my hackle pliers and we're going to give this a couple of wraps. You can just stroke the fibers back as you go. And tie that off. Pull off that tip. Hen hackle feathers are pretty, that the stems are pretty thin. Now I'm going to take tan goose biots for the wing case and we're going to tie them in with that curved side going down to the shank and you want these to go you don't want them to go past the body just to the body would be great take the other Put that on and when you tie them in you should have an X. Trim off the excess. I'm going to take just a touch more of the black dubbing. Yeah, we're going to hide that those thread wraps. Don't need much, just enough to hide those thread wraps. Now I'm going to take my whip finisher and give it a whip finish. About three is good. And before I pull that in, I'm going to put some head cement on my thread. And I have like three, three balls of head cement there. Pull that in. Pull it tight. And here we have David Swartz, Dark Lord. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope that you would subscribe to my channel. Please refer me to your friends. Leave comments, questions, suggestions. And most of all, thank you very much for watching my videos.